Hey everybody, welcome to a new tutorial. So here's the thing, I needed to reinstall my Mac because it was running really slow. Uh, and in order to do that, I had to make a backup. So um, I wanted to make a fresh uh, start, so I removed uh, everything from my Mac and I reinstalled from scratch. Uh, the only thing I didn't want to lose, of course, was my email. So in order to keep my emails and accounts and everything, I went to the um, library, then group containers, then this directory, uh, ubfat346g9.office, then Outlook, and then Outlook 15 profiles. So I copied this directory and I put it on a backup drive. This way I wouldn't lose any emails or email accounts. Once I installed El Capitan on my computer, once I did that, um, I moved the Outlook 15 profiles directory from my hard drive back to my Mac. Um, so I would have all my emails back. Now I'm dealing with this. Every time I try to find an email from my backup, let's say I type in this keyword, it will say no results, which is pretty annoying because I know the email is there. So uh, there's a pretty easy solution to this. You just have to find it and I'm gonna help you with it. First of all, just close Outlook. There it is. And go to your system preferences. In your system preferences, uh, in your system preferences, you can go to Spotlight and then click on the tab Privacy. Now, this list shows all the folders that Spotlight does not have to index, which means that if you have a folder in here, it will not be indexed by Spotlight, so it will also not be found once you go to Spotlight. My list is empty, so basically all my folders, including my emails, should be indexed by, by Spotlight, but that's not working. So the easy solution is to go to your Finder and just drag the Outlook 15 Profiles folder to here and then just close your system preferences. Now we have told Spotlight not to index this folder, which is weird because we wanted to index this folder. So go back to your system preferences, go to Spotlight, click on Privacy again, click on the directory or on the folder that you just added and now remove it. Okay. By removing it, you're telling Spotlight to go and index this folder again. Close Spotlight, close your Finder, and depending on the speed of your computer, it's probably going to take like half an hour, an hour, or maybe even more, depending on uh, how fast it's uh, indexing. But once it's done that, you will see that it will work again. I hope it will work for you as well because it, I know it's been working for me because I tested it of course before making this tutorial. Um, so let me know if it did. If you liked the video, like it. You can also subscribe to my YouTube channel and thank you so much for watching.